Hi everybody, I hope I am visible in this video. Um, yes, I know I'm a mess. I still have my black eye and I have no makeup on. But I'm going to do just a quick pre-recorded video for you guys today. Um, and I'm going to flip the camera in just a minute. But I will be kind of MIA for a little while. My daughter, as many of you know, has been very ill for the last few years. And uh, it's pretty bad right now. Um, so tomorrow or today when you're seeing this video I will go to my uh, follow-up for my eye appointment and then I'll be spending time with my daughter I don't know uh, exactly how things are gonna go I'm gonna take some things with me and I'll try to post when I can but please please keep my daughter in your prayers that she will remain calm and with as little pain as possible. Okay, I have to flip this now. So this is going to look a little weird, so hold on. Okay, everybody. So this is just going to be a quick technique I want to show you. Um, I showed you guys this cool card that we made at uh, Creativity Now on Saturday. So... I'm going to show you how we did this smear event. I'm not going to make a complete card for you. But um, I am going to be using the metallics, the metallic enamel effects. Um, I use the um, copper on that card. I'll be using silver and gold for my sample. But it also comes in white, red, and black. Um, just so you guys know. Okay, so here we go. They actually taught us to put it onto the palette knife, which I'm going to pull that out. Comes with a pack of three. One that looks to me like a a, a kitchen knife, <laughs> and then this one. I mean, they're all kind of cool shaped, but um, this is our palette knife. You get, like I said, three, and they taught us to put it on the palette knife itself itself. But I'm going to do something a little bit different. Um, eventually, I hope to turn this into a holiday card. So I'm going to use silver and gold. So I am going to just squirt a lot of it on here. Like quite a bit. I need to put some paper under this because otherwise it's going to mess up my glass mat. So I'll do that before I smear. And then uh, below that, I'm going to... Oops move that up. I'm going to put some silver. I'm sorry that this is such an unusual Tiny Tip Tuesday, but I know that you guys understand and we'll be praying for my daughter Brittany. Okay, let me grab a piece of paper. Alright, so now all you're going to do is smear this along and you want it to be chunky so you see I've got like a lot of it on the palette knife um, so and it's okay if it's lumpy and bumpy like this and then I'm going to do the same with the silver okay this isn't coming out just exactly like I expected but hey that's okay. But see how now I'm getting like silver and gold kind of mixed in together. So I don't know what this is going to look like when I turn it into a card. Look, I can make swirlies. So anyway, it's just a fun thing to do with our metallics is to create a metallic -y background. Uh, and if you want the edges to be better, just take your knife and kind of dip it on there you can add more or less depending on the look that you're looking for um i just thought it was a cool technique you can see this one i did very smooth with the copper uh it worked a little differently since i was mixing two colors it was just a guess what the heck i don't know anyway i just didn't want to leave you guys hanging um so i'll keep you guys posted um i am feeling okay um, I am emotionally a disaster case, and um, I, I mean, I know this, it's coming, I know it's coming, but 
you know, you think you're prepared. <laughs> and, and, you know, we thought, we thought that this was going to happen um, almost two years ago. So you never know. Um, she could pull out of this again and be with us for another couple years. But she looks pretty bad. So anyway, um, thank you for listening. And thank you for following me. And um, remember, if you um, want to place an order with me, um, it's Memory Inkers. Oops, I better move that. MemoryInkers.com is my um, Stampin' Up! website. And since I won't be very busy doing Stampin' Up!, I'm just going to say it. I truly appreciate any orders that you send my way. So um, thank you in advance. All right. God bless you all.